Yeah, welcome to the dojo, baby, man. Listen, bro. If you deal with aggressive women, disrespectful women, women that just, you know, they want to wear the pants in a relationship, women that, that want to do this with you, one, two, skip, skip. Have no fear, Taekwondo is here. We giving out the cheat codes in the dojo, baby, man. Look, bro. When it comes to those kind of women, bro, the women that are disrespectful, they get all crazy with you, they treat you however they want, they talk to you however you want. And this is just a people thing in general, bro. Because I'm going to be honest. It, it, it's no way you kind of like just only taking that from your girl. Like, I'm going to just have to assume that a bunch of people in your life just treat you like disrespectfully and you just cool with it. I'm going to just have to assume that, bro. Because listen, bro. It's going to have to be a couple fundamental things that you're going to have to check in yourself to make sure you don't deal with those kind of things no more especially when you're dealing with women because what what happens is she might let's say she's an aggressive girl period right because i'm from philly bro so i already know cities like philly you know philadelphia new york chicago like all these all these very violent places our women are more masculine just based on the environment so then, as a man in this position, bro, you have to be a certain type of masculine because the women are already this certain type of man masculine. Now, I'm not saying every dude from these cities knows how to handle these women. But if you really want to send a lot to the gulag, you know what I'm saying, one-way trip to Dooney land in a Dooney van, then you're going to have to be able to be a certain kind of masculine to deal with these kind of women. It, it just comes from the competitive environment, right? With that being said... Being around that so often and seeing all them women and, and dealing with them, bro, they, they got a whole joke where it's like, yo, if you could make a Philly girl submissive, bro, you could wrestle an alligator. Like, that shit is a meme, but that shit is not a joke, bro. On some real shit. Because what it requires you to have in order to be able to do that is our good qualities dealing with people, period, in life. And, and here are two things I want to talk about. They kind of, it seemed like they overlap, bro, but I'm telling you, I'm going to make sure you understand the difference. Number one, you're going to have to be firm, bro. You're going to have to be sturdy or solid. I say the word firm. Firm is probably the best word I can use to describe what I'm talking about. And then the second thing is, you're going to have to be able to keep your cool. You're going to have to have like some sort of emotional control or self-control. Not just being able to tell yourself not to do something, but emotionally as well. And why is this important? Why is this important when dealing with aggressive women and disrespectful women? Let's start with being firm. Number one, if she's treating you like this, she's disrespectful to you, rude to you, and acts all this kind of crazy, bro, that's her way of saying she doesn't respect you. I'm going to be real. That's her way of saying she doesn't respect you. Because somebody she's respect, she's not going to treat them and act like that towards them. It just is what it is. Now, there, there could be a couple reasons for that, but... Nine times out of ten, bro, it's it's cause she she smelt blood. She smelt some sort of weakness. She smelt some sort of like weakness or fear in your masculinity, and she attacked it and capitalized on it. It just is what it is. So you have to be firm and sturdy. But being firm and sturdy is kind of different from be, keeping your cool. And here's why: because you could be firm and not keep your cool, but you can't keep your cool and not be firm. And you're like, bro, what the fuck is you talking about? This shit don't even make sense. I'm going to give you an example. Let's say, right, she's yelling at me. Or she's trying to be rude and disrespectful to me. And you're going to see this in this video because I'm going to react to this video. I just want to make sure I explain these things beforehand so we can watch the whole video without even stopping. And then when something come up, I can just pause it and be like, see what I'm talking about? Because it's going to be Miami the Kid dealing with this girl. She's very disrespectful. She's very, you know, aggressive. And she's very rude, right? Now, sometimes when dudes deal with aggressive women, bro, you got you got one way that they do it. They'll be like, right. They'll be like, you have to be dominant. You have to put her in her place. You shouldn't have to put your hands on a woman to put her in her place. Now, the only way you could do shit like that, bro, and the only way you really want that type of time with her is if y'all have some sort of sexual thing going on like that. You see what I'm saying? So that, that might be a specific type of vibe with her where, like, she likes to be put on her place. She likes to be, you know, not gripped up and shit like that. You know, choked and all types of kinky shit, bro. So let's say that's y'all vibe, though. Let's say 
y'all on some like freak vibe like that where she likes to be put in her place. So her being rude or disrespectful to you is your cue to be aggressive because she likes that shit. We're not talking about that. That only works when you have that type of vibe with her. Y'all have that type of sexual tension and energy with each other, right? Let's go for the general situation you run into when you're dealing with these kind of women. Is that they'll just be using it to test you as a man. That you're using it to test your masculinity. You have to be firm. Firm is that you set your boundaries and you put your foot down no matter what. That is different from keeping your cool. Because in order to be firm or in order to keep your cool, you have to be firm. But you can be firm and not keep your cool. My example of that is, like I said, she's being rude and disrespectful to you. You're firm, you're putting your foot down, but you respond out of an emotional reaction. You get just as loud as she is. That's, that's my best example of keeping your cool. Because most disrespectful women, bro, they'll be like on a level 10. Her energy way up here. She all rude, disrespectful, loud, and talking fast. and She's on a level 10. You have to be, you have to keep your cool. You have to, no matter what level she brings it to, how loud she get, disrespectful or talks fast, you have to keep your cool. You have to keep it on your energy level. You know why? Because leaders lead by example. Bosses push, leaders pull. So if you want her to be submissive, you want her to be calmed down, you want her to bring it down a notch, you don't yell louder than her. You don't spack hand her and slap her. Talk to her like this. You... Yo, lock in with her. Listen, tap in. Yo, 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 yo. I don't do that. I don't know if you talk to people like that, but that's not how you're going to talk to me. That's not That's not what I do. Now, if you're going to continue to do that, there's something over there with a round knob on it, and you, you twist it this way, and you, you know, depending on how you twist it, you, you might pull it, and it might open. That is called a door. I will show you exactly where the door is. I will escort you out. Tell you have a nice trip and send your ass right to the gulag. You'll be gone. I don't tolerate that from people in my life. Like you saying, you don't yell at her, bro. You don't go, well, F you bitch and blah, blah, blah. Who wants that? Who wants that? That's a waste of your, you lose your voice over there. You stressing, you getting gray hairs now. And imagine you hit her. Now you are, now you are a felon. Now you, now you just became a criminal just to put this girl in her place. It wasn't even worth it, right? So like I said, bro, being firm is important because you have to be firm enough to put your foot down in order to say something like that to her, in order to tell her, yo, watch your mouth. You're being very rude and disrespectful. And then she goes, well, I say what it, no, 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 no. You have to be firm. You, this is being firm, putting your foot down and not folding, not being swayed no matter what or how she reacts. That is being firm. So no matter, hold on. Even if you get that reaction out of her, bro. Yo, bro. Even if you get that reaction out of her, bro. It's just like you don't sway or bend no matter how she tries to react. You set the tone. You keep the vibe. And by you keeping your cool, that'll let her know how serious you are. That'll let her know that you're not here to play or you're, you're not a kid. You're not childish. You're not nothing to play with. So let's get to the rest of the video. Let's let's watch this reaction. Let's see how Miami the Kid handles it. Let's see what's good or bad. Let's let's look at, you know, so the room, what the girl is doing and how she acts. Yeah, that's his name. I want to oh, give you his real name. I'm Maybe here, he'll I'm let here, you I'm know here. that. Oh. This is a little late. Yeah. yeah, I'm here though. And you're late. Nah, facts. My fault. Oh yeah, Miami. This is Alexis. This is My our fault. Teacher, even though y'all saying she the assistant. Yeah, this our assistant. Man. This our assistant. Like teacher. Me. Maybe you can teach me a few things. I probably can. You probably can. You probably can. Teach me a few lessons. Yeah, you probably have a lot to learn. How old are you? It's good. To, it's good to um get smart every day. Tried to test him. Look how he just ignores it. Yeah, you probably got a lot to learn. How old are you? You go watch my recent video. Women always try to get you with that. They always try to. They always try to find a way to just get you to prove yourself to them. But this is where you have to be firm and know you have nothing to prove. And even if you did, why would I prove it to who? you? Who are you? This ain't a job interview. This ain't a, a, a Six Flags ride. I don't have to be this distant in order to get through the door. Relax. Since you're not, you're not the president. You're not. Chill. Right? Already, she tries to do that. 
I'm grown. They ain't tell you this. They ain't tell you this already. Oh, that you grown? Yeah, I'm grown. What's up with the glasses, man? I like the glasses. She missed she miss bling bling in front of me. I'm getting blind. Got the diamonds and all that, man. And this is where I said, like, remember that example I used before where, like I said, like, if you have that type of sexual vibe with the girl, so you'd be aggressive and dominant with her? That's one route. The Another route is if you're smooth with it, and you know how to flirt and you know how to keep that, that masculine frame while you're flirting and being smooth. You could, you could be firm, maintain your respect and make it seductively like flirtatious. You could have that vibe all in one. But look at how he's doing it. He's gonna keep his same tone of voice. He's gonna make sure he's he's solid. He's gonna make sure he keeps his cool, no matter how loud she gets. Now we already watched this video on Twitch, so if you ain't tapped in the Twitch gang, you missing out. And I just dropped a video on Patreon on how to deal with shy women. So this is like the exact opposite. There's a whole lot of exclusive videos on Patreon, and you get other benefits on Patreon. It's all in the packages. You can read them when if you go check it out. How you doing? You didn't answer when I asked how old you are. I told you I'm grown, man. Alright, I'm grown. Now look what she trying to notice. She trying to look at him like she got like red dots like attached, bro. Like she got straight aimbot beaming into his soul. You didn't answer when I asked how old you are. I told you I'm grown, man. Alright, I'm grown. Well, you ain't why, why you ain't put the word in for me, man? I'm grown, man. Yeah, I don't know nothing about you. All mean? I can say is That's why she's feeling that energy from him. She trying to like Miami, don't go too hard on him, you know what I'm saying? I don't know what she what she like? Yeah, this is just to you know feel her out a little bit yeah, on the what channel. You, what, what you like? Get her experience in some videos. You know what I'm saying? This is her first time doing her a real video. Her rodeo, her yeah, she normally video. just does a little errands for us. You know what I'm saying? Run around town, send emails. You know what I'm saying? Get the sponsorships. So what, you, you know? what, what you do? You like to handle things. Yeah. You like you like to take control. Definitely. You like to drive the boat. Mm-hmm. For sure. Yeah. That's good. Okay. I mean. Like, that's what all the girls should know how to do. But how would you? You keep us. Because you're not answering. I'm not going to answer. You feel me? She's the assistant. Hey, I'm just saying you're the like, assistant. Exactly. You're supposed to I'm do everything. So I'm, I'm pretty sure yeah, answer questions but you want to Okay, and I'm not working for you. So. I'm saying. And that's hey, one of the things. I'm taking control. You, hey, I'm so. saying you could, though. You keep you mentioning it like you want to. Like you want to work for me. Like I want to work for you. Right? You're the you nice chat. You want to join Etiquette again? Where are you from? I'm from Miami. Mm, okay. Where are you from? I'm from New York. From the Bronx. Yo, where are we? Where are we finding them, man? Hey, That's man. what I want to know. That's not supposed to be. You can't me. tell you all that. Just saying, man. They got. They got what I As he like moves in and gets closer, and, you know, spreads his like domain out. She like leans back. He claiming that space, dominating the space. I'm here. I'm not after you know at first he's like, you know, leaning away for her, kinda like bawled up about it. But then he like, man, I'm saying let his nuts hang. Let him I'm saying flexing it out. Like, I'm here. What's up? Yo, where are we? Yo, where are we finding mixing, them, man? Fall back, man. Hey, that's, that's what like, I wanna know. That's not supposed you to be. can't tell you all I'm just that. saying, man. They got they got New York in the house. Yep. She from she moved to Atlanta. Yeah. I'm right here. Like I'm that just, that's the thing. I'm, I'm saying, right here. Like that, you you want to go out there with me? I'm saying we not blind right now. We can see so we right now. We just I mean, talking. I don't know you. And unless, that's the thing. You're unless, trying to get to know me, but you're not even talking to me. I'm saying How you I'm talking around to know you, bro. But you're talking you around like, me. So y'all peep what I'm saying about being firm and keeping you cool, bro. She's getting louder, she's getting aggressive, she's uh all that right, all that bark, right? He got the same tone of voice. He's still saying as chill as he is. He not getting quiet for her. Now, I'm a one mic kind of person. So, I, I just look at you like, why you just sit there and run your mouth? But like I said, I don't like to talk over people. I don't like to turn it into that. So, but he he, stand, he stays firm in his speech. So, he's not stopped talking because she's trying to talk louder. He keeps talking. Yeah, like you can't answer no questions. She's no, not listening. I asked you can she answer the same little, question. She seemed a little too ignorant to be a uh, ignorant, ignorant. Oh, you're running your Listen, mouth. I'm just bro, I ain't gonna lie. If she was from Philly, bro. She might have gave him a Mike Tyson round. Wow, she might have hit him with one of those, bro. I ain't even finna lie, bro. Yeah, wow. Straight, with crack this shit. Man, straight with a crack this shit. Easy, you making it hard for me. I am. Am I? That's probably because you're not working for me. That's mm -hmm. what that means. Mm -hmm. 
No. You ain't working for me, so I, everything I'd be hard on me. I guess so. What, 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 what's up, man? Oh, I'm trying, yeah, to, get, I'm trying to get her to work for me, too, man. Hey, man. Like, I need you life need to easy. Just man, man, you got to talk to her. Like, right like, right no, you're not. You're talking to your you right. you're talking to yourself. So, what's up? How old you? What's up? Oh, okay. Like, who mm. does that? I'm saying, you know, we could start off with a hand, and then you could come over and get an arm. An arm? Like, get, to know, right. get to know each okay. other. Alright, we don't do that in New York. No one just be all of us yeah, party on the, like, I'm saying we getting to know each other. Exactly, that's part of the so process, that's why I'm Hey, I don't know. Maybe you're too scared to get to know me. I don't know. Alright, so tell me something about you. I'm asking you questions. Tell me something about you. Hey, hey bro. I'm an artist. Hi. That's what I like to do outside of controlling and controlling managing who? and handling business. Controlling who? Kelly? Things. Oh, I'm, I'm thinking you're talking about just in general. You know, I am like, talking in general. You're the one I just tried so to specify. Like, I'm saying you like to control everything? That I like to stay to in control. You like to control a grown ass man? No, I, like, I mean, um, I like people to be just, alone, but I'm saying I like to be like, in control you of like things. Control, I didn't say I like to control right. people. Problems. Though. I don't control people. Problems I gotta get fixed. What? Or you like being controlled? Yo, who is this guy? She is the assistant. Who is this guy? You, you what is she, your sign? I guess she. What like, is your sign? My son. Yeah. My son, money son. Oh my gosh, are you serious? What's up? You're not. Nah, yeah, when is your birthday? Come on. Right? That's what the fuck it means. Okay. What's your sign? When's my birthday? Every day. Oh my, my god. Birthday, my birthday. Uh, this is an example of staying firm, but how like staying firm and keeping your cool is kind of two separate things. He's firm and not giving her his birthday or his zodiac and all that. And he's also keeping his cool by just flowing a conversation, staying in his masculine frame, staying normal and chill about it. Really? You're talking about, I'm making this hard. So, so every attack of her trying to be aggressive and trying to be all rowdy and all, you know, rude and disrespectful. Is she's looking for him to crack. She's looking for that that tweak in his arm and that little weakness. She's looking for him to like respond or get some sort of reaction. And she's not getting it. He's just responding how he wants to respond. He's saying what he wants to say. He's acting how he wants to act. You're making this hard. Today. You're making this very hard. I know, I your know birthday that. is not today. I'm saying my birthday. What's your ID? Listen, my birthday is today. What's your ID? This is our first time meeting. Right, so what's your, your ID? What's your ID? What's your ID? This is my wallet. So let me see in it. In the car. Oh man, here goes the excuses. Me? You finna come get it with me? We gotta take a look at the commercial Huh? What kind of car you got? A fast car. A fast car. Yeah. Okay. You like fast cars? What do you do? Huh? What do you do? I'm a businessman. You know, I work with them. You know, I'm an assistant. What are you? What I'm do you a business do? Businessman. What kind of businesses do you have? I'm a man who followed the plan. And, that's to get, and what kind of plans you got? What rich. kind of plans you got? That's to get rich. And what's the plan? Oh to get rich. That's the goal. And so what's the plan? plan? That's Yo, the goal. What's the plan? This is the plan is to get rich, man. That's the goal. If you notice this as well, bro, he not even giving her the answer she want. He doing all this while being mysterious, while saying what he want to say and doing what he want to do, bro. So all her being aggressive and all that acting all crazy, that's just an affront or an act. Like she's trying her hardest. And mind you, she ain't even get really as disrespectful as I remember from the first time I seen it. But let's just keep watching. Go. Whatever come with doing, do what you gotta do to get rich. You feel me? Maybe hiring a cute assistant. You feel me? Then that could be one of it right there. Ooh. Look, look, look! A slick compliment. A slick compliment. And this is why I say I say I personally don't do compliments. I can get a girl to do all that without getting comp without complimenting her. But like I said, if I had to, I would still compliment girls better than how most niggas do. And this is an, ex this is an example. Smooth dudes know how to use compliments properly. He didn't just meet her and just say, oh, you look cute. He, sli he slick smoothly slicked it in there. And it was relevant to the context of the conversation. Oh, yeah, I'm a businessman, you know, such and such. If I get a cute assistant... That's his way of calling her cute. You know see what I'm saying? Like, he didn't just come out and just validate her out of nowhere. Oh my God, you're the most beautiful girl in the world. No, no. Slid, slid that jump right in there smoothly. Things. Look at her face. Caught off guard. Caught off guard. She can't stop smiling. Maybe hiring a cute assistant. Jimmy Jimmy that could be one of it right there. Ooh. There's multiple things. 
that's gonna lead well, me that to the, now, that's multiple things that's gonna lead me to the gym. What's the it dream? Probably could be one what's of the dream? To be rich. Man, what's oh up, bro? Oh my gosh, what's up with you, just bro? to be rich. Just man, what's to be up rich? with you, man? What's you don't you, even what's, have a plan. What you want to do? What's you don't have a plan. Uh, so Maybe listen, not what your let, the, right, are let, all right, let's, let the assistant what instant the kick in. Give me some plans, then. Give me some plans. See, she fighting it like shit too, bro. She not trying to submit to his game or smoothness or nothing. She not trying to at all. I don't know what your interests are. I told you. She's still battling for the aggressiveness and battling for the dominance. I want to get rich. You the assistant. Just let me know what your interests Listen, are. You the, what is your bro, interest? Whatever. It can't be whatever. I like anything There's that. A hey, to do I like world. anything that got to do with money. So you help me out. Yeah, it could be What's, anything that's like what you think? It's about what you're willing to maybe, do and what maybe, you want. All right. So listen, maybe we can do the same thing together. What you think? What's your interest? I doubt it's what your business is. Huh? I doubt it's what your business is. What you mean by that? The same thing you said. Why this girl be? She got the only fans, cause that's her only plans. Do you hear me? Being complicated, man. <laughs> I feel like you're being complicated. Huh? You're being very complicated. I'm being complicated. I'm eased out, man. Yeah, I'm not, I, I, you, you don't want. You don't want to be being uh, Miss Feisty and all Miss that. Miss Feisty. Stuff. Oh gosh, here we go. Miss Feisty and all that, man. Uh -huh. I've she, heard. She got the bling bling. She looking good. She just thinks she can sit here and interrogate me, bro. Like I ain't finna bite back a little bit, bro. You was already biting. I didn't even bite you. I'm saying. You already started biting. You bit first. I really didn't. Well, look, look, look. Smoothly, like, playing the victim on purpose. Like, why? Like, what she keep acting so aggressive for? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he feel the battle and the energy that she keep trying to do. And even so, he didn't fight her back or bite her back. He just smoothly maintained his frame, maintained his composure. And there's some some chill shit about it. And flirting with her. She like it, too. Yeah, like, she what does like, she hate? She's trying to bite like me. I try to... Yeah. Well, if you didn't bite first, you look like you, you want to bite. You to bite me. I try to bite you? Mm-hmm. Yes, you did. Nah. Nah, I ain't, I ain't trying to bite you. I do that. This day gonna be over. Okay, so um, she forward now. You gonna you gonna pull up some errands for me to do, for you to do? Yeah, right quick? I have work to do. What do you have to do today? Work to do for what? I got some extra work on top for you to do too. Listen, you still. What's that? Hey, you still haven't told me how old you is, bro. And you still didn't do the same. Ladies first. I asked first. Bro, ladies first, dog. First managed, come, first serve. Listen, I could provide I that, first. so that's I what I'm saying. First. All right, well, you're not going to know because you ain't answered. Don't respect my shit when I asked you first. Yo, so how am I supposed to respect your shit to, now bro? when you ask me? Like, I'm supposed to just Yo, give you that. Yo, who you talking to, I'm bro? talking to you. I'm talking to, what's your name? Like, Yo, what's, what's your real name? name? What's your real name? What's your real name? What's your real name? My real name? What's your real name? You really want to know? Yes, that's how I like to see you. Okay, so if I take my real name, that's how you going to speak to me? Mm-hmm. Daddy. Speaking oh, my, that is not true. Where's your ID? That, Where's your bro, ID? I told you, yo, I told you it's in the car. If you want to go help so me, go get it. Assist go get, get it. it from me. So go get it. You finna help me? I'm not your assistant, so you you need to. All right, well, maybe home. maybe I might consider you being my assistant after this. You want to come help me? Maybe it's the first test. No, it ain't no fucking test. Okay, then, no bro. So that means you don't want to know for real, then. Oh, no. oh my gosh, you're chatting. So listen, y'all give her a task. I don't think she could complete it, man. She worried about everything. Yeah, you know she she's not the best. What? She's she not. What? She broke around the. He is not the best. Got it. Got it. Right. W man. W man. man. What you what you think about his New York hat? You know what I'm saying? He got a New York hat on. He I see, know. He wore it just for you. What you think about it? No, he didn't. He just for you. I'm telling. Come on with the limp line. If if you say something like this, you gotta be like. At the same time, she gonna know you trolling, but but like it's flirting, but you trolling at the same time. Like, oh yeah, I wore this hat just for you. Look at his face. I'm just saying. I think it's a high. I'm telling you. I'm just saying. I think it's a high. It's high. I mean, it's just a coincidence. Maybe this right here means something. Mm -hmm. Maybe you this. believe in signs? Nah. And look, he never said he wore it for her. She just was like, yeah, this was just a little coincidence. Now she's talking about you believe in signs? Oh, submissive. Look, look at her energy changing. Maybe this right here means something. 
Maybe you, you believe in signs? Nah. Maybe you say right what here. What do you believe in? Man, yo. I believe in God, not karma. <laughs> Listen though, bro. So, so like, we gonna actually have a real conversation? Yeah, I'm open to it. You're the one who's so playing games, chatting. Good, right? That's what I mean by hey, chatting. Man, That's yo, what we are thinking with. I'm gonna get comfortable right doing. quick, man. I ain't never like. Oh, talk to how? Oh no. I ain't never meet a girl. I'm not gonna talk to somebody hey, who's laying down, being bro. rude, looking like they about to go to fucking sleep or nah, some shit. Listen, bro, I ain't never met a girl that like, gave me a headache in five minutes, bro. I'm glad. I keep my feet. Well, up if you never forget. Hmm? <laughs> what? What you said? I can't even remember. You just threw me the fuck off. <laughs> my boy just asked her to can he flip his foot around her. And then child like played up what? What'd you say? <laughs> what? Give me a headache in five minutes, bro. I'm glad. I keep my feet up. Hope you never forget. Hmm? What? What you said? I can't remember. You just threw me the fuck off. I said I could keep my feet up. No, life. you can't. That's always like, what? How dare you? <laughs> How dare you? So that's disrespectful? That is rude. Why? Because I don't know you and you I'm put your feet on me. Like, what? I ain't finna put my feet up all up. Why are you? Oh, that's what you I'm just asked. I'm gonna turn you on. That might be one that's of your you fetishes. Just, it's just, really not. It's probably your fetish. Nah, that's why I you probably wanna do it. I like money. <laughs> Listen though. Oh. I'm just saying you were assistant. I feel like you know. Yeah, but I'm not your assistant. So what is this? Like, are you trying what, to hide hey, me? What is, or are you so, trying to like? So what it gotta what take? What it gotta what take? Is to be this? What it gotta take to be that? What it gotta take to be that? You let me know. So this is an interview. This is not date. Huh? This is an interview, it's not a date, correct? This is an interview for you? No, you know what? It's not, fuck your interview. What you mean, bro? What you mean? Hey. I don't know what type of shit Kelly P got you on. I don't tolerate this, man. Hey. I don't tolerate this. Like, when did you just... See what I said, bro? Men who's firm and how they allow people to do things and, or, or, you know, set their standards and boundaries and like... They just don't tolerate these things. And that's probably why he really stopped, like, trying to press play on her or even stop caring to spit game to her because it's like, I don't even want nothing to do with it. She might even look good. She might even, whatever. I don't want nothing to do with it. She's doing too much for me. She's being too problematic. I, you, you, at the same time, you could know how to put her in place. You could know how to do all this. But it's, it's always your choice as a person if you want to deal with that or not. Yeah, I know how to put her in place. Yeah, but mm, is it even worth it, though? Come from. Where you come from? You the one that walked they in here. They told me about you. Where I work. This is where I work. What are you doing here? You walked in here. Well, you invited me. I didn't invite you. Man, listen, bro. <laughs> this is crazy. I think I might got to say bye bye to you. I'm, I'm on, I need to see his ID. But this was a good interview. Me and uh, this interview. This was not an interview. Listen, me and this is an interaction. Me and this young lady right here gonna proceed to uh, go look for my ID. What? I didn't say I was going with. Huh? Why not? Go look for your ID. We gotta look for it together, bro. <clears throat> I think it's time for this video to end. Hey, yeah. Hey, we gonna look get little man to get Hold a turn, man. Wait, wait, wait. Tom, yeah. Tom, hey. Tom, yeah. Tom, I don't know. Who? Do you she mean, think? Oh, I'm, yeah. yeah. I think. I think why would you order a pizza, bro? Huh? You didn't never order the pizza for early. You ate it. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Never ordered so, it. So, listen. What do y'all got her here for? What do you mean, what, bro? Listen, this, man. This was your date, bro. What bro. do y'all got this girl here for? I mean, what are you here for? You haven't answered shit. You don't even say nothing. You want to interrogate people. Man, listen, bro. You just here to look good, bro. Listen, what are you here for? Listen, you ain't helping out with nothing right now. Yeah, she come to you're work not helping out with nothing. You're not helping out with nothing. What are you here for? What are you here for? Bro, that's why I say he's a smooth troll. Because he, he like making her mad, but making her smile at the same time. It's like he pressing on her buttons on purpose. Like he fucking with her on purpose, bro. Hey. I'm about to strangle him. Fool. Whatever the fuck your name is. Whatever the fuck your name is. Hey, bro. What is what is no, a strangle nigga is crazy. Bro, you ever let a girl... Choke, put her hands around your neck, bro. Let's go ahead and log out, bro. What are you here for? What are you here for? Hey. I'm about to strangle him. Who? 
Whatever the fuck your name is. Whatever the fuck your name is. Hey, no, because clearly you're the one who said your name man, is. Don't talk to me crazy. Don't talk man. to you crazy. You talking crazy. Yeah, you talk doing a whole lot. Man. Yo, listen. Yo, that's eight times. Listen. Up, oh my god. Yo, I'm going to kill him. Man. Why she, man? Hold on. And man. he's touching me, mm -hmm. and I don't even hey, know him. Cut out these cameras back quick. She trying to make me catch a case, man. What's up with you, man? Yeah, off of Why me. Why you trying Why are you being so like. Yo. <laughs> this ain't such What is up with you? Hey. Like, Yo, she tried to sneak that little blowing. <laughs> this is such what a is up with you. Hey, I'm <clears throat> what power level y'all niggas giving that during that? Yo, <laughs> this is such what a is up with you. Hey, I'll get up on your level with this. This ain't nothing, man. Yeah, <laughs> I think she knocked the masculinity out of Miami right here, bro. Hold on, hold on, bro. Hey, I'm my boy didn't turn into Mickey Mouse. Get up on your level with this. This ain't nothing, man. Just put your hands out my face. Hey, listen. This. I'm sorry. Is a problem. Appropriate. You this, touching me not appropriate, bro. You touched me. Well, you liked it, bro. You started really touching didn't. me back, bro. Because I'm not. Come on, she he, she liked it. Y'all peep a lot of little things too. He be throwing stuff on her. Like that might be one of your fetishes. That might be one of your kinks. That's what you like to do. Oh, you like it. This is like he keep, he also keep putting stuff on her because he know he know she might be scared. She might be like a scary ass girl, so she like aggressive, but still at the same time shy to be a freak. Like shy to shy to come out like how she is. Not shy, but it's too early. Last girl. Little eyes. <laughs> okay. But it'd be comfortable to do that. Hey! So that was the end of the day, man? Damn. I don't know if y'all gonna do with this, but she is not it. <laughs> so, so yeah, we, but you, 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 you wouldn't fuck with her no more? Hey, you wouldn't go with a date with her again, man? It. Hey, Kel or P, when y'all gonna have to give her some discipline unless y'all gonna call me? 12 seconds later. What the hell is going on? Can y'all cuddle right for the one time? Please. Can you cuddle him for the one time? Can you cuddle with him? Can I choke him instead? Nah. Should I do this? Nah. Please? Stop! I'm about to squeeze your fucking nipple. Yo, what? Yo, <laughs> Yo, leave all the kinky shit at home. Sis, what is you talking about? I got no team, man. So what? So what? I'm still squeezing it until you fucking cry. Man, hey, bro. Ain't no pain for me, See, man. she can't stop cheesing. She can't stop smiling. She loving the body. <laughs> all right, bring it up here, man. Thank you. Acting like a little girl, man. No, I'm not. Yeah, you had to like all right, crazy. Bye, 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 bye. I am Bobby. Have a nigga grow you up right quick. Man, you act like a little girl. No, I'm not. Here we go. Man. Look, no resistance at all. Nigga. <laughs> she right where she wanna be. <laughs> Got Miami. Look at the camera, bro. <laughs> niggas know. From I got me, niggas, know. bro. That's when he knew. The shot sunk. That's when he knew the half court, the that was shit was green. It was all net. That's when he knew the shot was cash. Just look at the camera right now, bro. If you know, you know. It's your birthday, man. Yeah. I think it's cool down. Yeah, nigga. Yeah, look cute towards the camera or something. Uh, <laughs> that would look stiz. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That would look stiz. Yo, why? Yo, Get up in there, Y'all both man. look at the same time. Oh, you look at her or something. Shut up! Shut up! Can I get y'all for one minute? Y'all just look at each other, like... It's you. Runs. It's bad. Just, uh, it's, it's not a kiss. If you look at each All other... All I ever wanted was to run it out. It's raps. And by that moment, he knew. She booked her one-way trip to Dooney Land in the back of the Dooney van straight to the Gulag Bay Beat Man. Dojo to the moon to Saturn and we leaving the solar system. The limps won't even know we exist. 70k pack on the way ASAP. No Rocky. 